Hey guys, Bryson with PRD Design here and wanted to give you guys a look at the Easy Care F250 that we just finished up and it's actually getting ready to go on the trailer right after we're done to uh, make its way to Colorado. So, uh, 69 F250 flare side, one of 973 built in 69. And uh, it's uh, originally a fire truck from Ventura, California. So uh, you can't see it on this door, but on the passenger door, it says the uh, Ventura City Fire Department on the door itself. Uh, so it's got some cool uh, old uh, history to the patina that's on it. And that was part of the reason for leaving it as it is, is to save and preserve the history and the way it looks. Um, we did add the Easy Care logo. So that's where the name comes from, uh, which Easy Care uh, is uh, the company that uh, Garrett Ford, the owner of this truck, uh, runs and they make a bunch of horse care products. So this truck, uh, again, patina on the outside, uh, but we redid everything else. So essentially the only thing it doesn't have is a new paint job on the outside. Uh, all the underneath has all been uh, refinished with uh, Raptor bed liner spray that's been color matched and uh, to uh, factory primer colors under the cab and then some orange uh, bed liner that we use inside the fenders and some other areas underneath. Um, it's got a 2017 uh, 5.0 Coyote motor. So we uh, refinished the whole engine bay and uh, custom valve covers, custom engine cover, and uh, really got this thing to where it just didn't look like a stock Coyote in here. Uh, although essentially uh, it is uh, internally. Uh, stainless steel headers and exhaust, uh, all American auto wire wiring, uh, power by the hour did the control pack and everything for it. We tucked the wiring away uh, in order to uh, not be able to uh, see all the ugly. Uh, it's got electric power brake booster in it, uh, electric power steering. Um, what else under the hood? We've got uh, custom stainless steel radiator hoses uh, and fittings and uh, black nylon braided hose to go along with that. Aluminum radiator, uh, Odyssey battery, Ring Brothers hood hinges. Um, and uh, yeah, just refinished everything underneath the hood. So uh, on the inside of the truck, uh, the seat's all been done in leather, door panels, dash pad, brand new steering wheel, uh, left all the original paint in there, new carpet, new dash pad, uh, Dakota digital gauges, vintage air AC, custom stereo panel that we made that goes behind the seat here. Uh, so you can see uh, back there, just two six by nine speakers, the JL audio head unit, uh, amplifier and JBL the speakers are JBL along with the subwoofer um, this truck was ordered from the factory with shoulder harnesses which is a pretty rare option in these bump side trucks but uh, we were able to uh, get uh, new ones made to uh, be uh, replicate the uh, original shoulder harnesses that were in it so all new seat belts there um, new you know headliner all that new stuff so uh, it's got all new glass in it uh, everything's been completely redone on the inside. So uh, the bed has been, you know, obviously the patina has been left, but the bedwood is all new bedwood uh, from, from the company Bedwood. It's all black walnut. Uh, we have this tonneau cover that's on here, which is all aluminum. And uh, it's on electric actuators. So you get to hit a switch on the inside here and it raises the tonneau cover up. And then you can access the bed. It will go higher, but... Uh, yeah, so the bed's all been refinished, like I said. Aluminum tonneau cover. Gives a real nice look in here, be able to protect your stuff with the tonneau covered uh, down. Keep some water out too. So um, yeah, there's that. Uh, as far as the chassis is concerned, uh, 6R80 automatic, custom NP205 transfer case. Uh, we have all brand new drive shafts. The Dana 60 rear and the Dana 44 front have been completely rebuilt. 100% uh, inside and out, new, all new powder coat on all that stuff, all new leaf springs that have been powder coated as well, new bushings. We do have a custom setup of Fox shocks on this thing to uh, really help it ride down the road. And uh, man, for the, for the miles we put on this thing, I wouldn't uh, hesitate to say it's the best driving uh, high boy on stock leaf springs out there. And this thing, between the brake setup, uh, between the power brakes and the power steering and the uh, um, the Fox shocks, all that stuff, it really does ride really well down the road. So um, we do have uh, disc brakes all the way around on it. So it's a lug nut four x four rear kit. Uh, 
And then the front is a disc brake kit that we developed right here in-house at PRD Design. And uh, that's available uh, for sale. And we'll hope to have some information on the website here pretty soon about those. But uh, just wanted to give you guys a in-depth look on the Easy Care F250 and uh, show you guys our latest project that we have coming out of the shop. So hope you enjoyed this video. We'll show you guys some pictures and other things to go along with the build process. And uh, thanks for watching.